beautiful friends. You know, I have seen string beads in the stores, Instagram, and stage in magazines. And so I thought, ah, it might be a good idea if I tried my hands at making a string of beads. So during the fall season or Halloween uh, season, I picked up two packages of eyeballs from Dollar Tree with the purpose of making a string of beads. So I just proceeded to paint the eyeballs with Dollar Tree acrylic paint by hand. So you see it all worked out. The acrylic paint against the rough texture came out amazing. I let them dry and then touched up areas that I missed. Now when the eyeballs were dry, I applied Mod Podge from Dollar Tree with the intention of applying gold leaf to the eyeballs. I learned that I had to apply the gold leaf while the eyeballs were still wet. So in order to keep them upright, I punched holes in a paper bowl to get the balls standing upright and I put the balls on a barbecue skewer. Now I applied um, gold leaf individually to each eyeball so that each one would be unique. I brushed off the excess and wow, you can seal it with Mod Podge or clear Dollar Tree fingernail polish. Now then it was time to thread the beads and I wanted something a little bit different. I have thought about uh, possibly jute and I said, ah, these are a little bit too elegant. I had thought about leather thread and uh, no, that's a little bit too much. So I found some Dollar Tree, uh, very skinny ribbon and I thought, ah, let's see if that works. So I found an upholstery needle. And the nice thing about the upholstery needle is that it is long and the eye is big enough for you to thread uh, pretty much anything through it. So I was able to successfully thread each eyeball. Some was a little bit difficult, but I was able to do it. And look how beautiful the band of beads, AKA eyeballs look. So you can style it any way you like. And you can style it on books, you can style it on a bowl. Uh, just use your imagination. If you like what you have seen today, please like, comment, save, and subscribe. In addition, you can follow me on Instagram at Z9Designs. Thank you. Have a lovely day.